Alright fellas, while I was working on my new base design I found out two curious things. The first one is the chain link fences. Most of us know that we can shoot targets if they are on a straight. But accidentally figured out that traces has a different trajectory while you are shooting through it. And if we correct aiming due to this information, then <laughs> we can shoot mostly everyone in any direction. I've checked YouTube on this theme and there are only a few videos which I found and I watched shorts filmed by Mr. Seagrust, so as I didn't know it, I'd like to share it with you dudes. Water shows it in more better way, so if I want to shoot someone on my left on the bottom, I need to aim more to the right and a little bit lower than a target is. And if I need to shoot someone on the right, I need to aim more to the left. After you will figure out how it works, you are free to practice in spraying with it. And as we know, players can't shoot through two chain link fences. However, if there are one fence and one chain link fence door, it's still hard to shoot you. But there is no guarantee, dude, that you are in safe at all. <laughs> These fences are so broken and so weird, dudes. Well, the next thing is quick update due to my last video about sneaky and unlootable remote control auto turrets. As you remember, it was not shooting anyone when it's not operated by a human. However, you are were able to shoot and raid with a computer station without any uses. And the thing which I figured out is that if we raise turret on a half wall, it will be not so sneaky and still get damage, can be looted as well when it's offline, but it will pay back to everyone as a normal turret while it's online. And the one more thing came from a year ago. I found a video of Mr. Adder where he used different print for mostly same purposes. And it's also working now with the new update. <laughs> it's crazy dude. <laughs> the only thing is about right spot for turrets placing. With Mr. Adder's print you'd better to place it in this way and it's much easier to use a metal floor pieces. As you can see there is around 5 little square step from the back side. And this is how two turrets can cover 180 degrees round your base and or whatever you like to guard. And if we are speaking about triangle version, so it's better to place it in this way between two floor pieces and have two small square steps from the backside. But unfortunately it's not so unlootable. I found a pixel where you can loot it. But it's really difficult to find and it's not so obvious. You have to know that one year ago it was default pixel bunker. Well, thanks for watching dudes, I hope you loved this video. Take care and see you next time, much love.